What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> I brought my girl, Nikita Dragon, back, and we're gonna dive into some fun today. We have a first impressions on the brand new Urban Decay Vice Liquid Lipsticks. Mm. Woo! Yummy. Girl, we're like over here like, mmm. Uh -huh. Now, me and Nikita both are obsessed with Urban Decay. Love their brand. When did you first start wearing them? I didn't start wearing them at first because I was just like the gay boy at the time yeah. in my college or high school and doing the prom makeup with the naked palette. Yep, in high school. Um, I started, that's when, when I was in, I think 11th and 12th grade, I discovered Urban Decay in Sephora. Yeah. And you know what's crazy is that they just re-released some of their old lipsticks and their old <gasps> bullets, right? And those were the lipsticks that I first bought growing up and there was a shade called Asphyxia. And it was like this purple blue indigo and I was like that is a badass name. Mm -hmm. That's the sickest color. No one really had blue lipsticks back then. So I put that on for the first time and I was like, oh. <laughs> and I felt like <laughs> invincible. Like I walked into that high school like ready. Mm -hmm, bitch, what? So it's crazy. It's like been how long have I got in high school? 12 years now? Oh my god, bitch. No. My age? <laughs> 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 and it's crazy that they are so massive and it's so great that over the years it's just been like such a big success. And last year I had the opportunity to fly to New York and hang out with Urban Decay for one of their launches and the owner Wendy was so incredible and she is so intelligent and just immersed in the beauty world like she knows everything. She's like that. a dictionary of like beauty. Now you guys know that I reviewed so many liquid lipsticks on my channel. Every brand from drugstore to mm -hmm. very high end and I'm excited to test these out. I can't wait. Now, here's the thing. Tell me now. There's 30 shades. <laughs> which, first of all, I could never do that many on my own. It, on my Wait, mouth. is that why it was called? Is that why I was coaxed with Pizza Hut? Oh, hi. Uh. <laughs> so, I brought Nikita over to help me swatch these. We're probably going to do like six or eight each. Because 30, there's no way. My yeah. mouth would fall off. So if you guys want to see us swatch all the colors and learn about the price, more about the product, then keep on watching. Are you ready, girl? I think so. All right, so let's look at the packaging first of all, and let's do, we're, we're about to be Judge Judy up in here. What do you think about it? I love it. Very colorful. Uh, yeah, it's very bright. I think it's cute, and it feels nice. Come on, emboss. So it has eight lipstick shades on the front, which I'm sure are in the line. And, and now, then the lipstick shade itself is this. Yes, which That's is cool. cool. So it has the sticker. And there's two formulas. So there is a metallic, and there's also a normal matte. Oh. Now, look at this claim on the box. These are allegedly <laughs> waterproof, long-lasting liquid lips. Um, let's pop one open and see what the lipsticks look like. Ooh, okay, so first impressions on the packaging and the wand, everything, go off. Um, it's cool because like this one's a little bit smaller, like normally like the actual where the lipstick is, it's yes. a lot longer with a smaller cap. Now in the past, I have definitely complained about other brands having short like wands and mm. like it's hard when you have long fingers or maybe a normal sized hand and you're trying to do it and it's like tiny, yeah, like this little, part's little. tiny. So the handle is very long. Now the doe foot is interesting, it has sort of a slant, Tilt. it kind of tilts like my ex in ninth grade. And let's see, so this is like a plastic metal. Mm -hmm. It feels lightweight. Very light. I almost, want, I almost want it to be a little more Me too, heavy. I like it heavy. Yeah, so it is plastic, it's not like a metal. Oh yeah, what does it smell like? It's not, not, like not much bothered. I'm not bothered. All. It's not, not bothered. Yeah, there's no like vanilla, there's no like fruit flavor, no mm -hmm. sweet, and there's, but it doesn't smell crazy chemically either. Now the shade name of course is on the bottom, it has all the information. The package came with a little breakdown of what it's supposed to be. So it says, like their original lipstick formula, Vice Liquid Lip lays down intensely pigmented color, and the comfortable non-drying wear sets it apart from other liquid lips. Oh! oh wow! We're trying to snatch some wigs off! We've okay, girl. Cream. So 30 shades is a lot for mm -hmm. a brand to launch, which is cool. Obviously, Ur Urban Decay is a giant. They are, I mean, they're huge. They're everywhere. Yeah. So I think what we're going to do is just pick probably just some of our favorite colors that mm -hmm. we are seeing. And some of the names are very enticing, by the very. way. Very. Like, oh, okay. All right, so these pretty little tea girl mouths are about to get to work. <laughs> so let's get to swatching. All right, which one did you pick? I got MAD, but it has like glitters and stuff in it. Okay. Looks like M-A-D-D? -D? M -A -D, just 1-D. 1-D, bitch. Okay. One and then I have Twitch. <laughs> so All right. We both picked kind of in the purple family. Cheers. Purple. All right, let's see what happens. How are you doing over there, girl? <laughs> um, I'm trying. Is it cute? 
It's it's trying to be. I just thought it would be a lot like thicker. Okay. Like just applying it like any regular liquid, yeah. like creamy. Yeah. But this one the is just like. Coverage doesn't look as great as I thought. I'm it would trying be to as yeah well. build it up a. Okay. A lot. Well, this one has great coverage. This is the matte though. She has the metallic one on. Oh, you do a second layer. Yeah, I'm trying, but it's, it's like dispersing so weird. Oh, wait, okay. Like it was really oh, thin, and then all of a sudden it just fucking threw a gloss. Yeah, I see me. that. Okay. Like right here. Shit, okay. Alright, so I'm wearing the full matte, and what do you think about mine? Yours, I don't mind. I mean, it looks completed. I'm not sure how many times you had to go in it, but it looks yeah. completed. I, I dunked four times, which mm -hmm. is not that bad. Um, for some reason, I thought they were going to be like... So pigmented. Yeah, and I know mine looks pigmented now. Um, it just took like a few more times to go over mm -hmm. instead of like just one swipe coverage. Yeah, I did not have that with mine. Now you at all. have the what are they what are they called? The metallics. And what do you think about it? I don't know. I just was really trying to like dip in there and try to really work at it, and it was super thin, almost like a gloss at yeah. some points. And then the all of a sudden, really yeah, all of a sudden it just threw like pigment at me. And then it was drying really fast, and I tried to move it around, but I honestly had a really, really tough time. With this yeah, one. it looks. Not... And right now it's like really streaky, and it's just the patchy. glitter looks gl like gritty. How does yeah. it? How is the texture? It, it feels like really sticky right now. Okay, I want to say this: the matte one, not sticky. You feel my like not at all. No, mine is like I'm like trying to okay. open my mouth. Is it kind of gritty or no? Mm, yeah, mine's, really, mine's pretty pretty. Right okay, now. well, let's try some more uh, in the different in a different color family, yeah, and uh, let's take this one off. Okay, the claim of being mm -hmm. life proof, I kind of think that's really ag accurate. <laughs> accurate, very. It don't want to come off, y'all. Mm -hmm. Now I've done so many swatch videos. Usually, I, 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 <laughs> I'm at a loss for words. I literally have been watching Homegirl over here just work at this for. I mean, it's been five minutes. Am I wrong? I'm like, oh my god. The edges do not want to come off. I might mm -hmm. just have to keep going. So at least those claims yeah. weren't um, they false. Were, they were not false. Let's grab another shade. You try a matte and I'll try a metal. No! Yes! <laughs> no! Oh my god. Oh, that one's pretty. Look at the um, glitter. That so is really pretty. pretty. Ooh! And mine kind of has like an iridescence to it. Like purpley pink. Ooh, okay. Magenta? I have a nail polish that looks like that. That's right? Cool. Okay, what's what's yours called? Firebird. Oh, Firebird. Okay, cool. All right, let's try Big Bang. I see what you mean about like the they apply like kind of inconsistent. Mm hmm. All of a sudden it was just like dump product. Look at my top lip now. Yeah. It'll just be super thin and then go super thick. It's like, huh. what do you want to do? I oh, don't, wow. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but you guys, I literally don't have foundation on my lips or anything. You have nothing. Literally nothing. I love the glitter effect. Like when I'm back here, right? Mm hmm. When I'm way back here, when I'm looking on the monitor, I think it looks pretty close up. It's like too chunky for me. Yeah. It's, it's kind like of splotchy in a couple areas. Too. Yeah, it's like splotchy. The glitter almost like sits on top. Um, all right. I was really hoping this pink one was gonna like blow my mind away. Like when I first started applying it, it was getting there and then it kind of fell flat. Yeah. All right, let's try another one. So I'm gonna try another metallic because I'm a little shook at that Barbie one. Some like, boys deserve a second chance. Yes, okay, so this one is <laughs> called Flame. No, they don't ever, unless their dick's good. Okay, what's yours called? Back top. Back talk, bitch. All right. Back roast. But, oh <laughs> my god. All right, let's let's fucking try this out. I really don't like this one. I, I'm like, I'm I'm upset that these aren't working out for me. I see what the direction they're going, and I think I'd be so happy. Like I'm just like, please, like I'm rooting for you. Like I'm this really is, rooting for you. I'm I'm so y'all yeah, yeah, know I'm such a. Your Urban Decay fan, but this is not acceptable. It's so sheer mm -hmm. and like blotchy, and like for some reason, this one in particular feels like really like air. It was just so sheer. Yeah. I don't know, and it looks so pretty in the bottle. I don't, maybe it's the mica or the glitter they use. I'm not really sure what's going on right now, but I'm a little like, what the fuck? I can't get over it. Okay, yeah. let's talk about yours. Oh, uh, that one looks great. Yeah, I actually was able to really work this one. I've noticed, I think it might be the do, do foot. Yeah. This, I like really have to like get in there and work it because okay. I feel like it, it almost cleans the product too much. Oh, okay. So I was really able to like be super generous because now I know how to work around this one. Okay. All right, let's try a different color family. We got some dark stuff in here. We got some hot reds. We got pinks. 
Okay, let's take this off. It's raw. They are really hard to get off, which is mm -hmm. obviously a good thing if you want to keep your lipstick on all day. All right, so I'm going to try this hot red called Crimson. What are you going to try? Studded, which is like a, maybe like a green-ish olive with gold flecks. It says it's a metallic gray brown. <laughs> I tried, okay? All right, let's try this out. All right, how do you feel? Um, I feel a little bit better about this metal, but still, it's just so chunky. Like, I don't right. know what it, what that consistency means in a lipstick, but right. it's just really chunky. On I me. think it's the glitter, and maybe like ma the ingredients that are making it long lasting, and the glitter maybe aren't meshing. I mean, mm -hmm. I don't know. Obviously, we're not chemists. Now, this one is really pretty, but do you see how like a little bit here is just like a little like well, this is like, the, it's not as dark as that color. Yeah, I see. Yeah, like this is the most full opaque one I think that we've tried so far, mm -hmm. but I'm still, I don't know, I like I like the color, you know, I mean, I love a cool tone red. <sighs> Let's try like a really dark shade and then I think, I don't know, my mouth is like, I'm dying. help me Jesus. <sighs> All right, we're gonna take this one off, or attempt to, and we'll be right back. <laughs> All right, so we're both gonna try a really dark shade and I think, I mean, my mouth hates me. My mouth is just not, I know, we're so not I cannot swatch 10 more, I will, fall off of this chair. So we're <laughs> gonna do a final one. I think we've tried a different color hue each time. Mm -hmm. And <clears> in, <throat> between the metallics and, and the comfort and matte. The, mm -hmm. we've, we've tried a lot. So this one is called Blackmail. Ooh! And yours is called Disturbed. How I, like, I couldn't read that myself, so I need to read it. <laughs> All right, my mouth is like, holy hell, Jesus take the wheel. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Girl, I don't know. I've never had this much of a problem, can I say, with a lipstick. Okay. Maybe I've always played it safe, but I've never had one of those moments that's like, oh, this is so bad, like, not, like right. nothing like that. But this is, this is bad. Now, I always say in my reviews that darker shades are harder to make with liquid lips. Mm -hmm. And like, I don't know what it is, but this one is so streaky and patchy. I'm like, girl. Oh, like, now it's, as it's drying, it's getting... It's almost worse when it's dry. <sighs> mine, like, I want to cry right now. Mine's a lost cause. All right, I think it's time to give our final thoughts and see if this is Jeffree Star approved. I'm a little like shocked right now. Me too. Like I love Urban Decay so much and you guys know my reviews are just always 100% honest. I don't give a fuck who or what it is. Now, I, I just got to put it out there. Now that I'm trying to justify myself, let's keep that really, really clear right now. Mm -hmm. I am obsessed with Urban Decay's brand. You guys know I'm not a shady bitch. I just always am honest and mm -hmm. this formula was really lackluster for me. Yeah. And I, sure. I think on you it, <laughs> it spoke for itself. The metal ones I don't were I think worse than the matte. Mm -hmm. The glitter just was not amazing. It was like kind of crumbly and mm -hmm. gritty. And like you said, it was really trying to be long lasting, but I think it might have taken away from the glitter. Agree. Take away some long lasting and add in maybe, I don't know. But this dark one was so like depressing for me. Yeah. I like want to cry because I really wanted to love it and I was so excited to try these out and it definitely felt really, really flat for me. So obviously if you guys have been watching this entire video, you might have a small inkling of what I'm about to say, but Nikita, these are not Jeffree Star approved, sadly. Are they Nikita approved? No. No, not <laughs> And I, I'm like so upset about it. I'm like fucking pissed that I don't love these. But I know, I really like the packaging, the yes, root packaging rose, was a point. and all, all these amazing yes. great things. Um, I love the color story of the entire launch. I think that was awesome. I love the design of this, but- The shade names? The shade names are kind of awesome. I mean, Urban Decay always has six shade names, but mm -hmm. the formula, you guys, was not it for me, so. I definitely need to go grab some lip scrub yeah. and maybe take a, take a moment to pray. Take a bath, <laughs> have you sit on my face. Something spiritual needs to happen right now. <laughs> well, thank you so much for coming over today and testing this out for, for us, for everybody out here. If you guys want, not want, it's a need, click <laughs> the description box down below and go subscribe to Nikita's channel. Follow her on Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, Tinder, and... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. And I mean... <laughs> <laughs> and I don't think I have anything else to say except um, I love you guys so much and sound off below What do you guys think about the product on our lips? Mm -hmm. What color was your favorite and what do you think about our experience and what the hell is going on with our mouths? What's so, happening? 
<sighs> I love you, Nikita. Love you. I love all of you guys out there. I need a hit. <laughs> Bye, guys. Mwah.